at your bar, my is AK hashtag Gains. Before I start this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, stay up to date. With all my motherfucking videos, follow me on Instagram, Robert and Fitness, follow my band, Divided Dimension on, I uh, got some burp action, on Spotify, Divided Dimension on Spotify, all this should be in the description box below. Guys, I got some Lion Pack, Lion's Pack, uh, fuck's this shit called? Lion's Choice is the brand, Lion's Pack Edible Cookie Dough, these are the sugar free so I figured I'd just do them all at once, do a little quick review on them, rather than doing an individual for all these. Um, and to be honest, I've already have ate some of them. So I was just like, fuck it, you know? Fuck it. Ow, my back's still fucked up. All right, so sugar-free for these three. And then I have the limited edition, since this won't be around long, I was like, might as well throw that in there too. This is not sugar-free. So I'm gonna go over this one real quick first. So this is the Marshmallow Stardust. It's like a pink marshmallow-ish. Uh, two tablespoons, 100 calories, 5 grams of fat, 3.5 grams saturated fat, 13 carbs, 8 grams of fiber, only 2 grams of sugar, and 5 grams of protein. So that's for the non-sugar-free one. And then all these sugar-free ones are similar macros. I'll just go over the one because they're all similar. They're very similar. Two tablespoons, 90 calories, three grams of fat, 1.5 grams of saturated fat, 13 carbs, eight grams of fiber, two, uh, no, zero grams of sugar, obviously, because they're sugar-free, and four grams of protein. And that's the same for all these. So they all got eight grams of fiber, they all got 12 grams of carbs, and they all got four grams of protein. This one has four grams of fat, probably because of the peanut butter, yep. Four grams of fat, this one has 3.5, and this one has three. So they're very similar as far as macros. Now, one thing I'd like to mention is even the non-sugar free one only has two grams of sugar. So it's like, it's not that like crazy of a amount of a difference for having sugar free versus non-sugar free. So I don't see the benefits of really doing the sugar free if they're that great. <clears throat> and that's the other thing I want to mention. I think they reformulated their shit again because it tasted different. So hopefully Lion's Choice sees this or Lion's Pack I forget what the what's the company called? Lion's Choice, the Lion's Choice. I hope they see this review because um, I don't know. So we're gonna evaluate this shit. So twelve ninety nine per little ten ounce jar. Usually can get this shit on sale. Twenty five percent off coupon code. You can usually get this shit for around eight bucks a, a piece after it's said and done. Shipping is after shipping is free after twenty dollars is uh, an order. So you don't have to worry about paying crazy ass shipping. So that's fair. Um, so one thing I want to mention is when I reviewed the edible cookie dough bakeable, they fucking did away with it. And it was the best fucking goddamn cookie dough I've ever had in my life. And they re they, they did away with it. <sighs> so I was pretty upset about that. I didn't know about that until I already reviewed it and someone commented saying, Hey, did you know they discontinued? And I was like, Holy shit. Are you serious? So I looked into it and they fucking discontinued the bakeable cookie dough. So I was pretty upset about that. So then I got the sugar free. And I thought it'd be amazing. And so let's do a taste test. Where fuck's my spoon at? Yay, got some spoon action. All right, so this is the classic chocolate chip. As you can see, I already ate some. So this stuff is like, it's kind of dry and not moist and not cookie dough-ish. It's like, it kind of falls apart. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's less cookie dough-ish versus the other kind. It's like on the dry side and it kind of falls apart more. It's not really like a dough. It's like a, it's kind of like gritty too. The texture is a little bit different. It doesn't stay together. It kind of like falls apart and crumbles. See how it's not like staying together as much as like the other OG kind? I know you guys have seen my other review. This shit kind of falls apart and it's kind of dry. You would think as much as I love this shit, this would be a 10 out of 10. I keep it honest over here. As far as the flavor, flavor's awesome. But the texture is where they lose me on this one. And it kind of falls apart. It's a little bit dry. 
It's still good as fuck. Don't get me wrong. But they either change their formula or the sugar-free one is just different. Or they reformulate it or something. So the sugar-free chocolate chip, I would like to give it a 10, but I'm going to have to give this one like an 8.5. The, the texture and the fact that it's not as moist and, and together and dough, it loses some. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to go over to the Marshmallow Stardust. This is not sugar-free, right? So it should be the same consistency as like the original cookie dough and shit. And it, for the most part, is. I'll show you guys. See this stuff? It doesn't like, it's not crumbling. It's not falling apart. It's not dry. It's kind of all together. So this is like traditionally the same dough. Oh, yeah. See, that is the original dough right there. This is good. It almost just tastes like regular cookie dough with some marshmallows in it. And maybe they threw some pink, like, dye in it or something. I'm not sure. But this consistency is what I'm looking for. This one right here. I'm about to say nine. Nine on this one. Marshmallow Stardust. All right, so now we got the <clears throat> peanut butter sugar-free. And the birthday cake. So the birthday cake, same shit. It's got that like dry consistency and it kind of crumbles and falls apart. See that? It's like fucking crumbly and falling apart-ish. I don't know if you guys can see that because the camera's fucked up. But it's not sticking to the fucking spoon and shit. See that? It's less dry. I mean, it's more dry. It's still good, but it's not the same. Yeah. This one, 8.5. Now the, the non-sugar-free one, 10 out of 10. It's fucking dry and it's crumbly. I don't understand. I don't know if it's because it's sugar-free or if they reformulated this shit again. I can't tell. And the last one, <clears throat> peanut butter, the fuck's that say? Peanut butter dream. It does smell good, looks good, but same fucking thing, guys. Now, this one's actually a little bit more. See that? Look at that. It's actually a little bit better than the other one, than the other sugar freeze. So this one... It's actually moist, but it doesn't have that dough consistency. This is almost just like straight up peanut butter. Tastes amazing. This one's actually moist, but it doesn't have that dough consistency. It's almost more like a, uh, a peanut butter consistency. See that? I think this one's gonna get a nine. It's not getting a 10, though, I'll tell you that. Yep. So, my overall, I think they're still really good, but either they formulated it, and it's just not as good, or I got a bad batch. I can't really tell. Here's why. Non-sugar-free, consistency's on point. Everything's pretty much on point. Sugar-free, peanut butter... Uh, consistency, everything's on point, but it's just kind of lacking. I feel like both of these are almost the OG, like consistency and doughish, but <clears throat> these two are just dry as fuck compared to what they used to be, and they're both sugar free. So it's, it's, I'm having a hard time trying to figure out if they changed the formula or I just got a bad batch. So, Lions Pack, if you guys see this shit, uh, I'm still giving you guys good ratings and shit, but. It's definitely less than what they used to be, you know? 
I gave all the OG edible cookie doughs, non-sugar-free ones, fucking 10 out of 10s pretty much. I can't remember, but I'm pretty sure I gave them almost 10 out of 10s. And now these sugar-free ones are just lacking, and some of these other non-sugar-free ones are lacking, you know? So, at the end of the day, uh, I still like them. I hope I just got a bad batch, but, uh, I mean, they're still good. <clears throat> they're still good, but they're just, uh, they're not as good. And then the fact that they removed the bakeable edible, that fucking cookie dough was insane. The bakeable fucking cookie dough, edible cookie dough was off the chain and it was a bigger container. I have no idea why they re they, they did away with it. I, uh, I'm kind of upset about it. So, so as far as all these, I like them still. I still think they're worth it. If you can get a coupon code, do not pay fucking full price, ever pay full price for this shit. This is not worth $13. But if you say $8, it's more reasonable. I mean, it's reasonable. It's more reasonable, all right? I, I'm not saying it's not... I'm not saying it's still fucking... I'm not saying it's cheap. I'm just saying it's more reasonable than $13. So I'm going to get a classic thumbnail. Do all this shit at once. Yay. Yeah. see what I got here. Get some uh, thumbnail action. Here it goes. Yeah. yeah, that's the thumbnail. All right, guys, that's been pretty much it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for the support. As always, let me know what you want to see next. If you don't like to fucking mad, subscribe, share, like, and comment below. Scroll by no troll. And don't hate me because of fucking so. Yeah, I'm swollen underneath this fucking hoodie. You best believe it. Yeah. Uh, don't hit me because I'm fucking swell. Don't forget to follow me on almost social media. I'm Finis, Facebook, I'm Finis, Snapchat, I'm Finis, Instagram, I'm Finis. Don't forget to like my band page, Divide Dimension on Facebook. Follow my band, Divide Dimension on Spotify. And if you guys want Lions Pack to see this video, tag them on Instagram. Be like, check out from Finis' video out. The motherfucker just uh, gave his opinion on some shit. And you guys should see it. You know what I'm saying? All right. Uh, other than that, shop your supplement needs at TigerFitness.com in case you guys happen to need some supplements. Help support your boy. Use that affiliate link. Helps me out. Really appreciate it. Other than that, I'll check you guys later. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you watching Opera Men Fitness. Yeah. You, you gonna make all kinds of games. All kinds. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh!